how do people get hired in IT with no experience, with no certifications, with no degree? Yes, this happens, right? You've heard about it. You've seen it. You hear stories about it. You know, they get hired in help desk or whatever it may be. How does that happen? Stay tuned. Hey everybody, this is Zach with IT Career Questions and today I am going to tell you how people in IT get hired with nothing. With no experience, no degrees, no certs, with nothing. They just get hired in IT. They're 99.9% .9 of the time they're getting hired as help desk, right? Some entry level job, which is one of the best jobs to get started in IT, right? Happens all the time. How does it happen? You wow the crap out of somebody in an interview. Seriously, I'm not joking. That is seriously how these people get hired in an IT job, along with customer service experience. Those are the two biggest things that will get you hired in IT with nothing, with absolutely nothing. You wanna work help desk, customer service experience, and wow the ever living crap out of somebody in an interview. How do you wow the crap out of somebody in an interview? Tons and tons of customer service experience is one of the biggest advantages you could have to getting hired in IT, especially in help desk, especially when you have nothing, when you have no experience and all that, that is one thing. And having that customer service experience, having the ability to talk to people is one thing that will help you wow whoever you are talking to in an interview. Because what you are trying to do in an interview is sell yourself. That's it. That's what you're trying to do. And I don't care who you talk to, what it is they're telling you. In an interview, sell yourself. You want to get hired? You got to sell yourself. And I'm not saying sell yourself in a bad way. You have to sell yourself in the best possible way that you can. You love to learn new things. I don't know this specifically, but I love to help people and I love to learn new technologies. And I am such a hard worker. I would work overtime all the time, you know, whatever it takes. It's literally whatever it takes at this point. If you want to work in IT and you got nothing, you're going to do whatever it takes. Selling yourself to every degree possible is what you have to do. That is what it takes. That is how these people in IT get hired with nothing. It happens. And you know what? You know what's really funny about some of these people who work in IT with, you know, nothing? They're some of the best working people because they have this customer service experience and they have drive. That's what hiring managers and people who are hiring these people want. And that's what they see. They have drive and they have that want. They have that want to do better and they have that ability to help end users, their customers. That's what's really important, especially in help desk. And that's how you just blow up your career from there and blow up in a good way, by the way. That's how you expand your career. So if you wanna get hired in IT and you got nothing, or even if you have some of these things, the biggest thing that you can do to get hired, sell yourself, wow people in an interview. That's all it takes. And people are probably like, no, that's not. No, yes, it literally is. That's all that it takes. I'm 100% serious. It happens all the dang time. If there's no requirements on the job, if you don't need an A plus or a network plus or a CCNA or a two year, four year degree, go apply for the job. Even if they do require that stuff and you have customer service experience and you wanna work in IT, go apply for the job. Go apply for the job and wow the crap out of them and get hired. If this is what you want to do, don't let anybody stop you. Don't let me stop you. Don't let the person next to you stop you. Don't let anybody stop you. Go do it. Go do something. Go do something with your life. Don't let anybody stand in your way. That's what's up.